Hello everyone and uh, welcome to another uh, robotic uh, vacuum cleaner review. Uh, today we have here the uh, higher uh, XY uh, robot. Uh, this uh, is a newer uh, model released. Uh, it has a new technology, it uses a gyroscope and uh, with the aid of the gyroscope it kind of creates a, a map of your uh, home and it will know how to avoid obstacles and it will not go in a random pattern like uh, most uh, uh, automatic vacuum cleaners uh, do so this should be a bit more smarter than the usual ones so let's uh, first uh, take a good look at it and see what we get in the box and how it looks and then we'll see how it performs so without any more delays let's take a look right into the box so we are greeted with the product manual, which is a very thick book. So it does have some information here probably, and some of them may be useful, some of them maybe not. So you can configure this to work with Amazon Alexa. So uh, you can actually control this with your voice and remotely. And the booklet is in English and some other languages as well as, and it's uh, pretty good English yes no it's understandable shows the basic shows how to operate it all right so that is easy and here is the vacuum itself This is rather heavy and bigger than what I was thinking it will be. So this fell off from somewhere. I don't know if it's needed or not, or it's from transport. There were actually two of those into the bags, so this is the vacuum itself. It has touch buttons here. It has this little thing here when the product is in charge. Okay, so this also has wet mopping function. And let's see what else we get in the box. We get a cleaning brush, the side brushes, which have a absolute uh, well chosen color. Okay, uh, it's the charger the docking for it and we also get a remote control for programming and setting up which is nice All right, so let's see I don't want to wet mop so I should take this off Let's see if it comes off. Yes, it comes off uh, really easy. Uh, and you can fill this with water through here. And the water will slowly probably drip out through this uh, material here. And then it will uh, wet mop uh, what remains behind of the vacuum. That if you is if you want to uh, mop the floor uh, before you start to use it, you have to install the side brushes. And I don't know if you need any kind of tools or not, or if they are just clip on. And if they are just clip on, they have special clips, and that's it. And you have here markings. So this is an R with an R, so right, and we should have another one for the left. So this is a left, yes, and I'm going to click one left, and we are actually ready to go. It also has here a power button for turning it on or off. And please remove this strip before using, which I'm going to do now to see the internal of course I'm going to 
remove all the protection foil from it right away but I'm just gonna take a quick look inside look at this stubborn piece of paper all right and here is the container for dust not very large not very small and this is the epa filter which sits here that comes out really easily because here it's pressed and otherwise it won't fall that easy right and inside we get a fine mesh filter which has a rubber gasket for uh, better uh, keeping the vacuum it also has another gasket here so that's a good design and it also has a one-way valve so the dust won't fall out of uh, the vacuum when you are uh, picking it up and then going to put this back and get some instructions there all right we can wash it we can all right some other time maybe and let's see if i pour it on does it do anything all right so it sounds like a doorbell and you can plan spot clean and go home i'm now going to push the clean button And there it goes. Starting doing its job already. As you can see, the uh, doorbell uh, vacuum cleaner uh, works out of the box. Uh, that is out of standby. If you uh, don't use it and it's powered on it will automatically shut down to save power and uh, here is it in uh, comparison with the iLife uh, uh, X5 model so uh, let me put it like this so it will kind of both center on uh, my camera so there it goes they are uh, rather similar in size uh, what I must say about this is the fact that uh, it has uh, uh, more uh, powerful suction than the iLife this also uses a 4 cell lithium uh, ion battery while this one only has 3 cell lithium ion battery uh, and uh, of course this also has more powerful motor uh, it also has a, a larger uh, lift here so you can go over uh, larger obstacles than the iLife so I'm definitely going to test uh, one against uh, the other to see how they work so now I'm also going to do some uh, nice thing about this vacuum in, and uh, that is to peel off the protection foil from it you may like this or you may hate it and that's more like it it starts it's starting to look like it should uh, this uh, little uh, thing here is the infrared receptor for the remote and it has a special design a 360 degree design so it can capture the remote from any kind of angle uh, you won't have to be on top of uh, the vacuum with uh, the remote so I'm going to stop it to stop the doorbell alarm all right and uh, I also must say that uh, this vacuum also has a Wi-Fi connectivity so you can connect with your mobile phone to it and uh, program it for your mobile phone so you don't have to use the remote or uh, those buttons there you simply start the application which is convenient and uh, enter the settings I'm going to end uh, this uh, as a first part of the review because otherwise it will get uh, way too long and way too boring and uh, I'm going to do a second part when I'm going to 
test functions such as uh, cliff detection, uh, automatic uh, docking, uh, and uh, comparison with uh, iLife uh, uh, X5 to see. Maybe I'm going to do some uh, special uh, course, uh, put uh, them to pick some uh, of the dirt there and see which one is better and which one is more efficient. Also, I want to see the gyroscope in uh, uh, in a working state to see if uh, it does something special rather than bumping into walls like a regular uh, vacuum here. So all of those will be in uh, part two. So be sure to follow my channel uh, and uh, I'm going to upload that soon. Until then, bye bye.